You ready? Yeah, Well, that was exciting. Hope you enjoyed that. <laughs> wow. <coughs> we are in Costa Blanca. And it's warm. Not ridiculously warm right now, but it's a certainly a hell of a lot warmer than it was in our Barris Inn. Uh, we spent all morning trying to upload a video because, well, the signal's been really naff. But we eventually got there, had to stick the MiFi box on top of the clip stick and <laughs> wave it in the sky to try and get some signal, but that's all uploaded. Hope you guys appreciate and enjoy that video. It took what four hours, hours five hours to upload that video yeah, about eight. yeah. But anyway uh, right so now it's climbing time there is a little bit of rain forecast this evening so I don't know how long we're gonna get but we are at Gandia. crag called Gandia, Gandia. which um. looks like that Gandia is a single pitch sport venue uh, it's just got some nice nice cragging it's got these really cool little sort of archways and caves um, and the roots aren't super long which is one of the reasons why we picked it because it's been a while well how long has it been since we did any proper sport climbing like two years I think Two and, Two and a half years since did any full um, sport climbing. Yeah, I think feeling pretty strong for the first three meters, <laughs> four meters of the climb. After that, I think endurance might become an issue. So we've picked some short, steep climbs, hoping that plays to our bouldering strengths. first route was a complete sandbag most of it felt like it was going to fall down and there was a huge run out well, there was a huge run out for the first bolt and then there was a big run out for the second but up to the chains as well um, yeah it just felt like really insecure on it not the best start but found another route let's give this one a go
Oh, well, we were so short on daylight, and this is one of the few sheltered little bays, so I thought I'd just jump on something really short and sharp. Um, so, yeah, 7A on site. It's good. It's a good job I didn't go on a lot longer though, because my arms, I was running out of my bouldering strength and I've not got the endurance for long routes, but that was quite fun swinging around up there a little bit. That's 7A. <coughs> well, we got a quick couple of climbs in yesterday, um, but we really only managed well, the first day we managed sort of one climb. Yesterday we managed two climbs. Um, this because of the weather's been so poor. But we're back out, still at Gandia. Day three here, but the forecast today is a little bit better, so we're hoping to get a bit more climbing in. Though we do need to finish early because we've got an exciting big day planned for tomorrow, but I might tell you a bit more about that later. Um, but the sun is shining. <laughs> Still quite breezy, but it is blue skies, sunshine. We are in Spain, in the sun. Are you warm now? I'm not warm, yeah. I could do without the breeze. Uh huh. No, no thermal leggings this time, or hats, no gloves, layering. mittens, down jackets. Yeah. No double layer the legs. I haven't got like six layers on the top half and a gilet and a jacket and so, stuff. Yeah. One layer. <laughs> uh, yep. Alright, let's get warmed up. Well, I am warm. Well, okay, we are warm. <laughs> Alright, let's get the let's get the fingers warmed up. Get some roots in. Yeah. This is how climbing should be. <laughs> warm, sunny. Uh, in a t-shirt. It's too hot. It's too sunny. So British. <laughs> Storm alert. This is not a good place to be if there is a genuinely a storm coming in. 